last week we spent most of our time at the Adler Apotheca learning how German pharmacy is different than the American pharmacies that we're used to. We were split into three groups because some of the areas were kind of tight for space, but we learned about compounding and we learned about the chemistry that goes on in kind of a mini lab and we also learned about making herbal tea products. Um, we were taught by Frau Zimmerman, who is a technician there, and she taught us many different ways to use um, compound capsules and ointments. So we did um, a face cream, which was a lot more complex than we have done in the States, and we used um, different waxes and other techniques. The capsules were really interesting because it was a lot different than how we do it in the States, and it's even a very efficient way to do it because they can compound multiple capsules at the same time. Compounding is a very important part of the day-to-day -day pharmacy at Adler Apotheca. So in the little lab that they have set up at the pharmacy, they have lots of glassware, a flow hood, lots of chemicals, and they need to make sure that all of the raw ingredients that they're going to be using for compounding and for the teas are actually what the manufacturer says it is. So they do some different chemical analyses to make sure that it's correct. So a lot of these processes are things that we learned back in our pre-pharmacy work in our general chemistry and our organic chemistry courses. Um, we did things with the TLC, the chromatography. Uh, we so after going through all of these different chemistry procedures in the lab, I am very happy that the American pharmacies do not do this because some of these could take a very long time away from all of the other things a pharmacist has to do. Well, this week we learned about teas in the pharmacy and how they work with um, different herbal products and how they uh, put the different herb products together for different um, symptoms in German pharmacies. Uh, it was really interesting to see how it all worked. Um, because in the U.S. we don't do a lot of the herbal products, even though I feel like there's a, a trend in the U.S. that uh, more people are interested in using herbal products versus um, more traditional medicine. Um, we did learn some of the different herb, herbal products can treat different um, UTI type symptoms and um, different cough symptoms and different um, stomach like gas and things like that, some stomach issues. I thought it was really interesting seeing how they, all, how they put everything together and how, how often they use that product in, in Germany versus the U.S. At the end of this week we had to take a test where we um, were given a pre pre compounded tea, we had to identify the components in the tea. So there was four different different um, components, different leaves, uh, different flowers, um, and roots, and we had to pick out which was which, given what we learned about the teas this week. Um, as a German pharmacy student, they have to learn over 140 different uh, roots, um, different barks of trees, different leaves, and know what the medication, or know what they do for the body. So we had a really great week in the pharmacy, seeing the differences between what a pharmacist does in America, as we know, in a community pharmacy, and what they do in Germany, the community pharmacy. Um, and I really just wanted to say thanks to Frau Zimmerman for helping us with the compounding, and Frau <coughs> Slovak for helping us with the teas. Thank you.